Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and don't you just hate when you accidentally deleted your data and there is no way to recover it. Either you go to a data recovery specialist which is going to charge you a large sum of money that makes your wallet become empty or there's also another way that you guys can do while following today's video. So today I'm going to show you how you guys can recover the deleted files either on your hard disk or you know USB drives or right, on any other storage devices all right and can recover it instantly. And how am I going to do it? Well, it is with the help of this software right here, right? So this is the Mini 2 Power Data Recovery Free version 12.1. So um, this software is really, really useful. I've been using this software for a long time to recover some of my deleted data or, you know, corrupted data as well. All right, as you guys know, uh, as a content creator, we, I deal with a lot of footage, all right? And sometimes I might accidentally delete the recorded footage on my camera and this is one of the annoying thing because the camera has a delete button right beside the menu button for my camera wise sometimes when I press the menu you know I want to go to adjust the settings I might actually delete my you know my thing so in camera all right there is no you know in your phone there is like you no know, recycle bin but you know with camera once you delete it's gone so you know it is very very annoying so how am I going to recover all those deleted files well this software has helped me throughout the years and I've been very grateful and today I'm going to show you how you guys can recover it using this software as well. So right now I'm going to just show you the software itself and you guys can see for yourself how good this software is. But before that, alright, let me just show you, um, let's, let me just demonstrate to you something. Alright, uh, so I'm going to just delete the file All right, on one of my USB drive. I have a USB drive right here with a mini SD card inserted. It's a USB reader. Alright, I'm going to delete one of the files inside here. Alright, and I'm going to restore it using this software. So how I'm going to show you how useful this software is. I'm going to show you how incredible this software is. Alright, so uh, let me just insert it into my PC. Alright, so let me just insert the USB into my PC. Alright, let's wait a while. Alright, let me just open my, my file. USB drive D, alright, so you guys can see this is a USB drive. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm not lying or anything, alright, just showing to you this is the USB drive I just inserted, alright. So, we have a few documents here. This is the folder name important. So, the one inside here, we have a PDF form inside here, alright, and we have a shooter game. Alright, and um, yeah, it contains all the reports for all the information and everything that I did. So, you know, it takes a lot of time to do that as well. And a screenshot of a picture of me. So, uh, yes, I am going to delete this folder right now. So, you guys remember the contents inside here. We have a PDF document, a Frank Education Loan Application Form. PDF document, Individual Assessment Shooter Game. This is a report, alright, of all the codes on how the shooter game works. And as well as a picture of me, alright? So, what I'm going to do is go to this one. Just click delete. Okay. Oh, we're going to try again because I think I just recently opened it up in... Uh, uh, okay, why can't I delete this? Okay, now let me just restart this. Go to local drive D, delete it away. Alright, so yes, okay, so I've deleted it away, alright, and it is gone. So if I go to my recycle bin, alright, recycle bin, I'm going to just empty my recycle bin. So there is no way that I can get the folder back. So if I go back to USB drive D, it's completely gone. So there's no way I can get it back. It's not even in recycle bin anymore. So how? Well, let me just open up this software. Let me just open up this Mini 2 data recovery software. Alright, and you can select all the drive that is currently detected. So I'm going to just select the drive that is the USB drive D. So this is a D drive. Alright, just click on that. Okay, so we can scan. Alright, it will scan all the files and exclude and including the deleted one as well. So we'll just wait a while for your scan. It will show you the estimated remaining time, about 20 minutes. So while you're scanning, you can go ahead and do other stuff. You can go ahead and do your stuff, get a drink or whatsoever, and come back once it's done. Okay, so uh, yeah, so it has um found this document, which is the uh, first-person shooter report 
Alright, um, so yeah, the document has been found under the um, recovery docs. Alright, I'm going to just stop scanning here for now, alright. Uh, but you guys can see it has been found, so you I can I have the option to save it. Alright, um, but you guys can see, alright, but I don't have time to find like, you know, the PNG image because you can see the total amount of image they have, alright. So these are very old images, alright, that I was working on in Unity in like probably in, back in 2018, 2017. So that is like almost six, seven years back, alright. And this SD card has stored all this so long ago, one. So um, the best part about this uh, recovery tool is that you get to see, you know, um, the images itself. So it's really, really cool, alright. And yeah, there is over three thousand two hundred images being recovered, alright. And and that is still only twenty three percent done. So imagine hundred percent done. I think there will be over like ten thousand plus pictures. So uh, if I were to find back that picture that was deleted, uh, it's gonna take me quite some time. But uh, for this for the video itself, uh, I will not be doing it. But definitely you can see it has already found my um the the report the word document already over here. So I'm very very happy with that. All right, and yeah, they have also a uh, very well categorized. All right all the um the all different file types so if you are sure what file types you will delete it, all right or maybe if you know like oh you deleted a video you know it's a video so it should be under mp4 so you guys can see all the mp4 video all right and sometimes you can preview it as you guys can see this is one of the video i took i think very well, long time ago i think yeah i think this is like one of the intros i'll make for my youtube or something yeah it's really cool so this is so many years back all right so yeah they've well categorized it for you for you to find it easily all right or you can search it but i think because all of them are named i like, recover recover so you know it's not really really <laughs> okay to search it but yeah so you guys can see all right they will well categorize all these files so you guys can see what file type you want g files all the recovered g if you can preview them very very useful i love the preview thing all right it's not very buggy some of the recovery software if you preview it they will say not available preview unless you download it or you know but this one you can preview it in the software itself which is really rare and really really good so um yeah so once you have so found the thing that you have deleted what you can do next you just click on save all right and you can choose where you want it to you know uh, recover to so i just put on my desktop click on ok all right and it says recovered so if i were to find back all right my okay so i save it in ocbc submission all right lost file 4230 and the word document is here can you guys see it? So yeah, this is the recovered Word document. Let's see if we can open up in Microsoft Word. All right, so yeah, it's being processing in Microsoft Word. All right, while well, it's opening up in Microsoft Word, all right, let me just talk a bit about software itself. So you can preview all these things. So it's really really cool, and you can select by type as well. So you know you can select by document type, picture, audio, email, archive, database. So yeah, this thing can find every single. All right deleted data stored on the memory devices all right that exists throughout its entire lifespan so no matter how old it is all right so if you bought this if you were the first thing that you stored in maybe this usb drive or the hard disk all right is maybe a picture right from like 10 years ago all right the very first thing this thing can find that picture that you first thought in the storage device 10 years ago it's really incredible but you will have to take the time to find to look to look through like tens and thousands of pictures or images that you have probably um you know uh deleted so yeah, it's gonna take some time but you know if the something is very important to you or very whole very dear to you i think it's worth the time to just find it all right i mean this software is doing its job to help you find everything already so uh, i think it will be really really good all right and it has been opened up in the work document and you can see everything it is there so i can still move it around i can still edit i can edit the thing see okay all right so i can I can still edit it so um yeah it's fully recovered so you guys can see i've deleted that but it's fully recovered now so it's really really awesome all right I'm gonna just stop I'm gonna just stop scanning for a while. Alright, and uh yeah, there's also other thing you can do, you can export the scan result to where so you can see how much is scanned, how many data is scanned, 
you know, you can you can also filter, you can, you can also do filtering if you like filter by picture, video, audio. So you know, you just show up the audio. You, know, you, you can do by category, file size. So if you know like the exact file size, you can um, filter them so you guys can um, narrow down your search. You, know, you look through like a lot, a lot of things. So yeah, it's really, really awesome. All right. And you guys can see they also detected a lot of other partition as well. All right, they have desktop where you can uh, recover from a specific location where you want it to be. All right, they also have other utility tools that you can use as well. Really cool. You can see the scan settings, what to scan, what type of file type, what type of storage devices to scan, what type of you know, document to scan. And you can see the devices that connected. All right, so you can, you can scan through every single you know hard disk. So you can. You can scan anything, so it's really, really good, and the recovery is really, really good. So, if you guys want to recover or you guys want to test it for yourself, or you guys can go ahead and check out the first link in the video description down below. Go ahead and test it out. They now for the free edition, they give you one gig to restore. So, if your file that you want to restore is less than one gig, you can definitely go ahead and try it out and definitely get a license if you want to restore more than one gigabyte. So, yeah, it's very, very worth it. This software is really, really good works right out of the box all right and have no issues with it all right and the crazy part is help you save a lot of money rather than going down to an actual you know um recovery shop all right they help you do actual recovery they cost you a lot a way a lot of more money than you know purchasing this software itself so it is very very worth it all right and you can do it at the comfort of your own home you won't have to worry about your privacy getting stolen or you know read through by you know the data recovery repairman all right it's all in your control so it's really awesome all right and it works really really well for years i've been using this software i don't have any issues with it so once again if you guys want to check out this software and go ahead and try it out all right you guys can check out the first link in the field description down below down it for free you guys can recover up to one gig of free data so yeah that's all there guys if you find this video really helpful and did you know help you recover all the lost data that you um happens to delete it accidentally all right do give it a thumbs up and comment down below what you have restored all right and uh, yeah that's all for today guys and this is jforce gaming and i shall see you guys in my next video peace out i don't want to cry